Cheers. Oh, hi everybody. It's me. It's Friday afternoon, and it's a hot one here in Ontario, Canada. Well, actually, if uh, if the humidex wasn't so high, it probably wouldn't feel as hot. But thank goodness for central air conditioning. Yes, my throat is still infected. Yes, I have made a doctor's appointment. I was lucky to be able to get in this afternoon at four. It's around two here now, so in another couple of hours, I'll be going to see him. I count myself lucky actually to have a doctor. There's such a shortage of doctors here in Ontario, Canada. A lot of our doctors have migrated over to the States and left us wondering, now what do I do? But um, we managed to get a family doctor and oh, I'm so lucky to have him. And um, I just looked up and thought, where did I get that fairy from? But she's been there for a while on my desk. Um, I want to thank you all for the wonderful responses to that little vid that I put in um, about our trip up to Georgian Bay, Lion's Head and Cabot's Head. And I wish I could have had more time because there was so much more that I wanted to share with you from up there. Of course my camera only held so much but I didn't get to show you Wyerton Willie's statue or a lot of things. Oh, um, but I'm glad that you did enjoy what I did have to share with you. Um, there was one little story though that I wanted to tell you about when we were up there in Lion's Head and we were um, on our way wind on that winding road to go up to the lighthouse in Cabot's Head, north of Lion's Head. And it is so easy to get lost there because you're cutting into the wooded area. And um, for some reason we took a wrong turn, which is, like I say, so easy to do. And uh, we wound up on a, a dead end street right on the, it was really weird because it was right on Georgian Bay and all the little homes, the cottages are just gorgeous. And they don't have to be gigantic because my favorite one along there is called the Stone Cottage and it's just a little stone, all made of the stones. And it's just right there on Georgian Bay. Anyway, we, we got lost we saw this little lady, this little elderly white-haired lady, little petite thing, walking along. And it reminded me, I had this flashback to On Golden Pond. Remember that part where Catherine Hepburn is walking along the trail and she's singing her old uh, Girl Scout something song? And it was so cute. Man, my glands are swollen. Um... That's list what that lady, the lady that we saw, reminded me of. So we pulled up next to her, and I looked out the window and I said, "Excuse me, is this the road that actually winds around and takes you up to Cabot's Head?" "Oh no, dear," she said. "You have to go back. Turn around." She said, "This is a dead end. Turn around. Go back and turn onto." Um. <laughs> she looked off and she went whatever the name of that street is down there that you must have came down in the first place and Rick said oh yes I know the one you mean and she's so oh, good and she said and then after that she said and then you turn on to oh my <laughs> she she couldn't remember she said, and then she said, the sweetest thing, she said, oh dear, she said, I don't remember, she said, my memory is bad now, she said, but I do know that I live on such and such a street, and she said, and that's all I care about. <laughs> oh man, 
Isn't that great? Like she's living up there. This lady who had to have been in her 80s. I don't know whether her husband was alive still or not, but that's all she cared about was she knew the name of the street she lived on. <laughs> the heck with the rest of it. And she waved goodbye to us and and she went on walking so we had to turn around and come back and we passed her again and she was just walking along smiling to herself and um, waved goodbye to us again and we we found our way I just thought man wouldn't that be a wonderful way to live your golden years Oh man, life is precious. Anyway, I just had to share that with you and I'll let you know how things go after I get back from the doctors. Don't cross your fingers, it's nothing too bad, but I have a funny feeling I might need antibiotics. Talk to y'all soon. Bye for now.